Hello, this is Josh Pescator. I, I guess I'm speaking with the cousin of the guy from online that beat up Brother Nature. Yeah. Um, is there any way you can give me a little bit of background information on it? I'm working on the story for a few outlets that I'm I'm involved yeah. with. Uh, yeah, yeah. Finally, somebody paused. That way you guys get the real story because he's definitely brainwashing everybody. Yeah, that's what I do for a living. I used to work for Drama Alert. Now I run my own thing. I'm also in concert with a couple other mainstream media outlets and I want to make sure that I get the story correct um, and yeah. both sides you know are able to explain so Listen, he, he came in he came into the San, the, the restaurant is called La Sanduicheria okay in Miami it's a, it's a restaurant that's open until 5.30 in the morning alright right. so he comes in at 5.20 and they had already put up you know when um, the restaurant is closing yeah I was I was looking at that video and it looked like he was asking to be served at a table or something and asked for the manager. I couldn't really hear. Yeah, that. because the, 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 everybody that goes there knows you sit at the bar after a certain time. If you want to eat there, if not, you take your food to go. It's 5.30 in the morning. What do you expect? Right. You're not going to get a waiter there. They don't even do waiters there like that. You know what I mean? Right. So he, sit, he pulls the chairs down loudly, sits down, and he owns the place. Super arrogant. Like, I've never met... Listen, I, I know a lot of famous people. My uncle is Birdman's manager. Like, I know a lot of people. You know what I mean? Okay. So, I've never met somebody this arrogant in my life. This man is, t is treating these people like they're shit. Like, oh, you have to bring me the manager. The guy's telling him, I am the manager. I'm telling you, if you want, you can sit up here. If not, you can take your food to go. He starts bitching at, at this dude, like, fighting with the manager. The guy goes, bro, you know what? Get out of here. You're, 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 you're making a disturbance. You know what I mean? Correct. Yeah, that's what I was seeing on the See, on the video. When, when all this happens, I pull out my phone and I start recording, right? Okay. So you're the person that recorded that video where he was pointing at the manager and and yeah, dad the, was I'm saying. Yeah, I'm the one that hit him. I'm the one that hit him. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. All right. Yeah. So this guy goes and he he goes. I go. I start recording the thing. Then the girl he's with. In a, in a blue shirt, in a blue dress, you could probably see her behind the, one of the videos or something. Yeah, I think I, I think I see. When she comes walking towards towards us, you got me? Because we're on the other side of the thing, mind your own business, mind you, I have a, a sandwich in my mouth, you know what I mean? Okay, all right. So, we're minding your own business, this man comes, and he's there fighting with the guy, she comes up to me and tells me, um, oh, you can't record, you can't record, but gets like right, right in my ear, you got me? Okay. So I yeah. tell him, listen, take two steps back because I tell him, like, look, take two steps back. I don't know you. You know what I mean? We're in Miami, right? Like, this isn't like other places. Right. Miami at five in the morning on a Friday night. Miami at five in the morning. Like, what are you doing so close to me when I don't know you, lady? Mm -hmm. She comes up to me and she's, oh, you got it. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. I'm like, yo, you're crazy. I'm like, yo, get away from me. She goes up to Brother Nature. And then once she tells Brother Nature, oh, look, somebody recorded you. There is a video of you. Somebody has a video of you. He goes, who recorded me? Who has a video? Listen, that, that, and this. He starts screaming, like, who? And I'm here eating my sandwich, like, all right, bro, I know this guy is not going to come up to me and, you know, act this way. You know what I mean? Right, I feel you. Maybe if you he, if he would have told me, hey, look, bro, please, like, I'm drunk. Like, if you take the video out, it's going to mess up my, you know, my career or something. Bro, I would have taken the video off. Like, I would have been, all right, all right, I'm not going to hear but he just, he just came at you disrespectful and demanded. No, 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 no. He didn't even come at me. Listen to how he came at me. He goes, he didn't ask me for the video. He, asked, he goes, hey, you, give me your phone right now. Ah, uh, okay. He goes, he goes, let me get your phone. Let me get your phone. And nigga, I, I tell him, yo, bro, you don't know who you're talking to. He, he goes, I don't give a fuck who I'm talking to. Give me the phone right now. Give me the phone. You're going to uh, you're gonna have some problems. <laughs> what problems can you possibly give me, guy? Wow. And I'm, sitting, I'm sitting here, I go, yo, bro, take two steps back, or I'm going to smack the fire out you. Word for word. I said, I'm going to smack, I, I, no, word for word was, I'm going to smack the nature out of you, I told him. <laughs> okay, nice. I told him, yo, I'm going to smack the nature out of you if you don't take, take two steps back. Because he was mad that nobody noticed who he was, you got me? Yeah. Nobody, I... nobody in the restaurant knew who he, who he was until, like, after the fight that everybody's like, oh, my God, I think that's brother nature. Yeah, it took us a minute for it to confirm it was him, and finally he tweeted about it, so that's Yeah, when... but listen to this. So he goes, and they kick him out of the establishment, basically. When I'm there telling him, like, yo, bro, I'm going to smack you if you don't, like, get from my face. Like, I'm giving him too many warnings. I'm telling him, bro, leave, leave. I don't want to fight you, you know what I mean? I'm not, listen, my, my little brother, 
looks nothing like that. My brother is super small. I don't condone his bullying. I don't condone his nothing like that. My little brother has epilepsy. My other uh, cousin has autism. Like, yo, bro, I'm not, I'm not that type of guy. But you're not gonna come here and try to take my phone and like do this in front of everybody. like what are you going through? You got me? Yeah, yeah. That's so that's goes, really weird. He goes, yeah, he goes. He starts like, uh, like, bro, he's telling me like, oh, what, what are you trying to do? I'm like, yo, bro, you want to fight? Like, what are you, like, what are you saying right now? He goes outside. Once he's outside, that the sandwich people close the doors. He tries. To, you know when you're pulling on a door, like you're trying to get like force your way in. Right, right. Now he's trying to force to break himself his, his way into the restaurant again. So and then he points at me. He goes, "Oh, come outside. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. Come outside. Come outside. Let's fight one on one." I go, "What? All right." So I come outside. Like, "Yo, bro, what do you mean wait? I'm not gonna sit in here with, like with you out there waiting for you." I go, "Yo, what do you want to do?" He goes, he puts the set up. So I put my set up and I fought him. Like that was that was all self defense. Like the police went to the to the restaurant, spoke to the San, last time we your people, and they they left it as self defense. Oh, okay. That was we were, my next call was going to be to Miami PD to see if they wrote this up on report. But the way you're telling it, it seems like it was self defense, mutual uh, battle. Yeah, he was drunk. He was drunk out of his mind, and he was like, "Look, no, all right. So after this, this is where I want to get to because this is." You know, they're making a scene on, on Twitter and everywhere, like, yo, bro, like, something crazy, you know what I mean? Right. See, after, we didn't fight inside the first time. This didn't start off inside. This started off at, at the door of La San Richard, yeah, when he's trying to break in. When, once he's trying to break in, I open the door, I go outside, and he's there trying to fight me, so I fight him. Okay, I see. I see the timeline now. He's arguing with yeah. the management on that video happens first. He comes yeah, at you hard, the wrong way. Then yeah. after the management that I put down my phone because he's in my face, like, spitting at me and stuff. Like, basically, like, yo, when he's speaking, he's trying to spit on my phone. And I'm like, yo, I'm not going to... I, I, I hold back a lot, but I can't hold back anymore. Like, we're, like you're, dude, you're literally trying to fight me right now. You know what I mean? I, I totally understand. So it's he, he come fun. back into the store, and that's that when video this, of you I'm beating getting, his ass on I'm the floor. The video, when I'm getting the video from... The 10, there was, like, 20 witnesses. Listen, if I was doing something wrong... Believe you me, the 20 guys that were inside that place that I didn't know none of, it was just me and my little cousin. That's it. Those were the only two people that were there. Nobody jumped. It was me and my little cousin. Yeah, that's what uh, everyone was trying the, to figure out why no one was helping. And the, I, I said, we have to 20, talk with them. The we have to. The 20 people that were there, all of them were like, yeah, bro, thank you. Like, because he was really being a, a disturbance. Like, he was, you know, honestly, if you're that much of a celebrity, you should have people around you, looking out for you, and not letting you act that type of way. Yeah. I believe, I... You're, you're, make, you're making a fool of yourself. A matter of fact, I seen him at Live on Thursday. Was it Wednesday or Thursday? Yeah, it was Live on Thursday, the night that um that Kendall Jenner was there, and he was also acting a fool. That is very he's interesting. He's been acting a fool this whole weekend in, in Miami. He came up to the wrong guy. And now he's mad because he got hit. And why did he get kicked in the face and he got uh, beat up again? Because after he already got hit and beat up, that he's outside, we left him, he broke my shirt, you know, mm. I didn't care, I walked inside, whatever, I'm eating my sandwich at this point, you know what I mean? Right. Because I'm mad, I'm like, whatever, I'm going to finish my sandwich, I'm going to go. As I'm, I'm finishing my sandwich, talking to somebody that they're sending me the video of the fight, this guy runs inside the thing and sneak pun and sucker punches my little cousin that didn't touch him, didn't do nothing to him. Ah, that's I read your tweet about that about the dude tried to swing on my little cuz, and yeah, so this I grab, so I, I go and mind you, I'm on the other side of the thing. I go, I go to separate them. Now he's trying to hit me. I put, I throw, him, I punch him to the floor. He goes to grab my leg and I kick him. I kick him two times, and then right after that, I left. I wasn't gonna hit, keep on hitting him, but he kept on like try like do like like doing stuff. So I threw the water at him like, yo, bro, wake up, wake up, nigga. Like, what are you doing? Right. Like, wake up, wake up. You're obviously out delusional right now. Like, what are you doing? Go home. Yeah, I saw at the very end of that video, he started to walk towards the person filming like he was asking for the no, video. Li listen to this, listen to this. He tried to fight the kid, the black kid. There's a black kid that I even have his number, if you want his number. I Because uh, he sent me the videos and we spoke. Look, I, I had the screenshots of the dude going, yeah, uh, he, he was telling him, hey, bro, take your, lo take your loss and just go home. Because he's there trying to fight the black kid because the black kid was taking a video. He's like, you took a video too? You took, like, he got in his face. And I'm not going to lie. I was about to hit him again because I was right next to him. You got me? I got you. I totally I see how this happened. This makes more sense. 
yo, bro, yeah, thank you, dude, because I'm not, look, they banned me, <laughs> they banned my, 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 I can't, I haven't been able to get on Twitter to even defend myself or nothing, neither that I care, because at the end of the day, you know, the truth comes to light, there's videos inside of the restaurant, there's a, there's too much, like, there's too much evidence, like, yeah. everybody in the restaurant is on the, it, like, there's too much evidence. Yeah, I, if you can give me the number to the kid that, uh, recorded that, because, Right now, I just saw TMZ picked it up. I got a couple of people that are <clears throat> asking me for a write-up. A, a good friend of mine that's a really big YouTuber, his name is Cabos, he actually wanted to get you on interview on his channel. Um, he told me if I can get in contact with you, uh, you know, would it be all right for him to contact you? Um, yeah, I want I want the real story to come out because I don't I don't want nobody no police knocking on my door. Okay, that isn't even like that. You know what I mean? That, that's totally like, cool. What 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 name do you want me to give for for you? You you can use the name that is listed on the on the Twitter account. Okay, okay. And what is the name and number for the kid that did the video? Look, I don't know his name. Okay, well that's fine. That's fine. I'm a, I'm gonna give you the. Okay, that would be great because I would love to talk to a third party. Yeah, uh, his name is Jay. All right, so this guy, the the black kid that that um, Brother Nature was also trying to trying to step to. Uh huh. And tell him about, look, I have the text of him going. That nigga tried to step to me too. I told him take his L while he can. He goes, and then he goes. He doesn't want me to step in with y'all like that. You get me? Other people were play, were like, yo, bro, do we go and hit this guy too? Because he was just trying everybody. Like, I hope that you get this chance to like exploit how much of an arrogant asshole he is behind camera. You know what I mean? I will definitely uh, explain this to all, all the YouTubers and the news people that I know that are covering the story. All, all people, all people uh, see is oh, Canela, Canela, this. Yeah. Yo, I read it. the first thing before they suspended my thing is like, why would you beat somebody up that's trying to help the environment? Dude, he was trying to fight me. What? Because he goes and cleans up big beaches. I'm supposed to let this guy treat me like I'm some spick or something? <laughs> yeah, Crazy? that that was my, uh, that's the whole problem I had with this video is I, I was like, well, you know, it, it must have been something that Brother Nature was uh, being argumentative and then he wanted to fight but I couldn't get the timeline straight I didn't know if the outside was the first fight or the inside was the first but now you explaining it to me you know when he was trying to break into La Sandwicheria again because they had clothes on him already if anything looks you could get hit for breaking an entry right right he's trying to break he's trying to, they're closing the doors on you bro and you're still over here trying to break in you get your hand inside once I see that he's here trying to make so much commotion I know personally the guy from the like sandwich shop not personally but I go there almost every week and see, you know what I mean? Right. And the guy, the guy's there like, like, no, no, this is not, not in this. At one point, even the guy's like, yo, bro, like, like, hit him. Like, what, what is this guy doing? Dude, like, like, what's wrong with this guy? He was just making a, a big commotion inside the, the restaurant. Well, I'm going to put this out. I'm going to give up your side of the story to everyone covering it so both sides can be, you know, equally talked about. I see exactly where you're coming from, and I can picture exactly what happened in my head. And in my opinion, I think you were in the right to defend yourself. And since the police came and they were able to judge the situation, I don't see how you're at fault. Um, but Yeah, I, I see something that he was like, oh, that, um, that he was trying to sue me. One, sue me for what? Yeah. And two, two. How are you gonna sue me when you're the one trying to fight me? Like, what? You're gonna sue me because you lost the fight, dude? Like, what are you going through? Yeah, that's. Uh, I think he's trying and to. Plus, plus, and oh, okay. Can you put this on the thing too? You know what this little prick said? Um, uh, when he's walking out, the first time that he's walking out, like that, he was like, oh, and then then that's when he started like trying to break in. Was that? He looked, He gets on the phone, looks at me and my cousin. He goes, oh, you two, you two are dead men. And walks outside, and then that's when he got like hyped up, I guess, by the girls or something. Mm. And he started like, "Oh, come outside, pussy!" And he started open, like trying to break in. And that's when I came outside. That makes one hundred percent sense now. You know, like listen, you can any person that's looking a lot of stories and stuff knows what somebody's lying, bro. Like I'm not, I'm, a, I'm more, <laughs> dude. I'm telling you everything script by script. I'm even giving you phone numbers that you can go and verify with. Yeah, you've been I more than more than upfront with me. I don't know if you've seen the, he just put, Brother Nature just put up a small video 
of it was just him dancing without his shirt on but holding an ice pack you can clearly see his face fucked up but he's smiling he didn't say anything about the the fight that was what tmz just posted on theirs and yeah he, he went in on and no he po- he posted something he posted on he posted on my my cousin's phone. My cousin's phone just got. Oh, you look. Know, how did you get the phone? <laughs> he, oh, okay. No, no. But I'm saying like he he posted your your phone. He posted your address. He posted my. He's trying to make this seem like, dude, we're from Miami. Like I'm not. I'm not scared of nobody. I'm not running from nobody. It is what it is, and it was what it was. I'm sorry that you had to be so much of an asshole and not conduct yourself professionally. Yeah, it seems you're, you're supposed to be a you know an entertainer, right? What do you do trying to cause fights with supposedly quote unquote your fans? Yeah, I mean I have Instagram and I have Twitter, and I don't even I think I thought of the guy like he was pretty cool at first. I thought the guy was cool until I met him. And, <laughs> bro, I, wish, I wish I would have never met that guy. Imagine, uh, look, he was fighting with the bouncers I live, and I could get you there. I I know all of them. I get, he was fighting with the bouncers that live because they weren't letting him go down through the bottom. Like, I get special treatment at live. Right. And I walk through, and my boy's like, oh, I can't let you walk through with all your homeboys. I look back, and I'm like, bro, I don't know none of these people. When I look back, it's brother nature. It's so crazy I ran into him again. Wow. That... He, went, oh, he, was, he was at Booby Truck yesterday. Like, this guy isn't, you know, he's not... <laughs> Yeah, we've He's we've gotten thing. we've had our behind the scenes stories of him, you know, kind of not with that squeaky clean image that he puts up with the animals and stuff like that. I've never really covered him that much before. I remember years back I did a blurb about him, but this kind of reinforces that I thought, idea. I thought the dude was like a like like a figure, like a public figure, this and that. Bro, I seen this guy taking bumps inside the club. <laughs> like, what's like, dude, what are you doing, bro? Like, you, you don't think that people know who you are and know, like, dude, I literally, like, this was I did? Yeah. Good Lord. Well, I tell you what, I'm going to jump over here uh, to my editor, my team. I'm going to tell my homeboy Cabos. I'm going to give him your number if that's cool. He'll call you. He's in the UK. I don't know how he wants to schedule it, but he has a extremely large YouTube channel. It's over a million. Uh, Right now, my news network is not up and running for video yet. We're just doing uh, articles and such. But I really think that it would serve to have you on his show talking about this because this is a this is an amazing story. Um, yeah. So, so is it, it, it honestly? That's what I thought while I was eating my sandwich. I was like, bro, I can't believe this guy's really gonna land on the news right now. But I me neither. I don't know why he even. I, I don't know. He, he, I would have never put myself in that predicament, honestly. I feel you. He should have bodyguard. If he wants to be acting like that, look, but let's put this perspective out. If that guy would have had a bodyguard, that means the bodyguard would have probably tried to punch me to take my phone away. So what would have happened when I would have shot the bodyguard for trying to touch me? You know what I mean? Yeah, it, w- it would have been. This is, thank God that he didn't have a bodyguard because the that, that situation would have really escalated. But, yeah, because we're concealed carriers. Like, we have conceals. We don't, these aren't illegal guns. No, we have our legal guns that we can legally carry. Yeah, I saw that on your uh, Twitter account that y'all were licensed to carry. Everything was cool. Um, yeah, we're, we're all licensed to carry. Everybody here is licensed to carry. And, oh, matter of fact, we didn't even, I didn't even, we didn't have a weapon uh, that night. We had just came from the club. We, we, we came from the club, we went to eat, we ran into that disaster. Because we were gonna, we were gonna go to Wells after that, and we weren't even able to do nothing. Because my hand, my hands messed up. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yeah, it's ridiculous. It's honestly, he should really feel like an asshole right now, and like honestly, he shouldn't have even gone to Twitter and done none of this. Because, bro, look what you just did. He yeah. Exposed himself. Like now, you guys are gonna go and say this, and he's gonna lose a bunch of followers for being the asshole he is. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Well, let me jump over here, and I, I'm going to holler with Cavos. He'll probably give you a call here in a bit. Uh, if I need anything else, I'll give you a call back. Um, I've got I, I, no problem, no problem. I knew this. I knew there was some shit in the game with this story because it doesn't. No one just starts fighting for no reason in a, in a shop, you know. Bro, I'm a I'm a pacifist. If if you, look, you can call and ask the guy. 
You can call and ask the guy, the the owner of the not the owner of the place, Jay, the the guy that was working. Right. I told him more than six times, yo, bro, you sure this is what you want to do? Or right, like I'm telling him, yo, get step back, get away from me, get away from me. Is Listen, I'm not I'm in the state of Florida. You want you want a person one time, and you can shoot him the second time. Right. The stand your ground law. Yeah. Anybody that knows the laws knows that. If it, I fear for my life, you know what I mean. Right. You've got then the I, right listen, to defend I yourself. Outside, I went outside after that that man saying, "You two are dead men," and he got on his phone like he was in a crossfire. I don't care who you call, bro. We're in Miami. If you kill me, you're killing me. What on camera, dude? Look. It's ridiculous. Um, do you know if that sandwich shop is open right now? Or yes, sir. It's All open, right. But it's not. It's definitely not the same people. But I can I can give you the the phone number of the guy. Uh, that'd be great. The phone number of the guy is 